Hello, this is a tutorial on how to use a height map in Maya 2016. So what you want to start with is to just create a plane polygon. Uh, I'm going to center mine, and uh, you want to adjust the width and height appropriately. What you want to make sure is that the width and height are of the same ratio as the height map you're going to be using. So my height map is square, so my width and height is square. But if your height map was uh, two by one ratio, you know you'd have you'd have it like that. Okay, simple enough. Uh, subdivisions. These are quite important. It's effectively the resolution of the deformation. So I'm going to put mine to 128. Don't want to have it too high because it it gets exponentially slow as you increase the numbers. One thing to remember is if your image is not square, you want to subdivide it so that these are square. Okay, so the each face is square, and uh, that means your subdivision width and height will not be equal. Okay, it's just something to remember to make sure your landscape is nice and even. Okay, so here's the important part. You want to make sure that you're in the modeling menu set right here, and uh, navigate over to deform. Just click that and click on texture that's going to apply a texture deformer and we're just going to find the height map you want to deform it with just click here and then click on file and I'm just going to find mine just downloaded it off the internet it's called heightmap.png simple enough all right so that's it it has now deformed it but it's not at all strong enough uh, as strong as I'd like it, so I'm going to click on the plane, navigate to the texture deformer attribute, and increase the strength to 10. All right, actually, now we'll have it 25, it can be the Himalayas. Okay, so that's the tutorial, that's it, nothing else, simple as that. Thanks for watching, goodbye.